Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, I'm Farron. I do all types of beauty and lifestyle type content. So if you enjoyed today's video, not only do I need you to give it a thumbs up, leave any comment that you may have down below, but I really need you to consider subscribing. I really wanna hit 5,000 subscribers. My goal was by May, but you see what day it is but i can't get there unless you subscribe so please consider doing that for me and let's get into today's video if you saw my video about products that i'm currently obsessed with i also told you guys what i was excited to try and i had just picked up these products from nature's little secret and i could not wait to try them out now some of these products are new. Most of them are just new to me. I have never used this brand, but I have heard really great things about it. The first product that I'm gonna be using today is a fenugreek detangling pre-poo, but if you know how I am, I always shampoo my hair before I use any type of pre-poo. Anything that you're supposed to do before shampoo, I go ahead and shampoo my hair because how else is it gonna work on dirty hair? So I'm just gonna like rinse my hair off really quick. And while I'm doing that, I'm gonna give you all the details on this pre-poo just in case you've never heard of it or used it like me. The fenugreek detangling pre-poo made with fenugreek extract is great for all hair types. Fenugreek is one of the oldest herbs used for cooking, but this ancient spice is excellent for hair care. Fenugreek has been known to help with hair growth and various scalp issues due to high amounts of nicotinic acid. It also contains lecithin, which helps strengthen and hydrate your hair. Our handmade fenugreek detangling pre-poo will melt your tangles away while promoting hair growth, softening hair, and strengthening your follicles. Directions. Before cleansing, distribute evenly on wet or dry hair. Leave on for 5 minutes and use fingers or comb to detangle. For extremely dry hair, leave on for 15 to 20 minutes and detangle. Rinse well with warm water and follow up with a Nature's Little Secret shampoo of your choice. I am so far thoroughly impressed with this fenugreek um, detangling pre-poo. For one, I just am really glad I can apply this directly to my scalp. The ingredients are very healing. I love the properties. It almost feels like this has an aloe vera like base and the way that it is gliding through my hair. Actually, if you have been on my channel for a really, really long time, um, Sheree Del Sol had this like fenugreek pre-poo that I like really loved and would make and it would like just glide through my hair and really help me detangle it. This feels a lot like it. It had guar, guar gum in it. Like I have everything to really make this. And so like since I'm not really into, you know, DIY anymore, this feels amazing do y'all see like how it is defining my curls and like they're so defined that it's really giving me volume does that make sense because each coil is so separated they're literally like stacking on top of each other i love it for detangling so far um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to let this sit for a good 15, 20 minutes. We'll see. I'm going to do some things around the house and, um, I'm not going to set up my camera and shampoo my and show like me shampooing my hair, but I will come back and show you guys like what it looks like initially. And we'll just kind of go through this wash day step by step but yeah i'm excited about this this was such a really good start a few of the key ingredients are distilled water of course you have fenugreek you have irish moss there's red rose olive oil sunflower seed oil and sorbic acid of course the guar that i mentioned and peppermint oil pre-poo is officially rinsed out and i mean so far, like, I like it. I felt like it did what it was supposed to do. 
I either want my shampoo treatments to like target my scalp and detangle or I need them to be a bond builder. So it did what it was supposed to do. So now we're going to go in with the lemon and rosemary clarifying shampoo even better like i said i want to, i just want to see what this initially looks like uh i'm not gonna do the whole shampoo situation on camera wow look at how instantly it just kind of lathered and i really appreciate any sort of shampoo that has this nozzle that i can get directly to my scalp so We'll go over this while I kind of massage this in really quick. Lemon and rosemary go way beyond flavoring water and food. They both have amazing benefits for your hair and especially your scalp. Lemon and rosemary removes dirt, oil, and product buildup. They help to fight dandruff and stimulate hair growth. Due to anti-inflammatory and antibacterial properties, they help to keep your scalp healthy. The sulfate-free pH balance lemon and rosemary clarifying shampoo will deliver ultimate cleansing while caring for your scalp. Directions say wet hair thoroughly with warm water. Apply the lemon and rosemary clarifying shampoo to your hands and use your fingers to massage the shampoo onto your hair and scalp. Rinse completely and repeat if needed. For best results, follow up with the cucumber nourishing shampoo or one of their conditioners. Mm, I lied to y'all just that quick. I got so carried away. But for this to be clarifying, even though I haven't rinsed this out, it just feels, I can't explain it. It's so soft. It feels very nourishing. Like, look how I can detangle my hair, which is like really important to me now when it comes to cleansers. And I can just really get in here to my scalp and pull this down. This feels really, really nice. I do wish there was some tingle to it, as I was saying, but obviously a little goes a really long way because look at this. This is nice. Yeah, boy, we are moving right through this. Um, I only shampooed once. I felt like that's all that I needed but it was not stripping at all. My hair feels clean. There's no definition to it, but that doesn't matter. It's clean. I have my spray bottle here, and now we are getting to what really drove me to even make this purchase in the first place, and that is the brand new Agave Nectar Moisturizing Treatment. Can't wait to try this out. Agave is an excellent ingredient for hair care. It is known for its humectant and moisturizing benefits, which can help to keep your hair healthy, shiny, and soft. Agave is rich in vitamins A, B, and E, and is also a good source of minerals like calcium and magnesium. It can help to reduce split ends, improve elasticity, and soothe an itchy scalp. Additionally, it can help to protect your hair from environmental stress and damage while providing hydration and nourishment. Our Agave Nectar Moisturizing Treatment will restore your dry hair and scalp, leaving your hair feeling healthier, soft, and moisturized. The directions say apply conditioner to freshly shampooed hair, gently comb through hair from root to ends to thoroughly distribute the conditioner. Place a plastic cap over hair and leave on for 20 minutes, rinse with warm water. And at this point, it's kind of obvious that I'm attempting to multitask. So let me tell you what I felt about this moisturizing treatment. I love the scent, absolutely infatuating. I love how thick and creamy this is. It is heavier going onto my hair. I don't know if you noticed, but it's literally weighing my strands down. But I don't mind that with a moisturizing treatment, especially with it being a treatment mask. I actually love to see it. And I really wanted to soak up a lot of that nourishment while I let my hair deep condition. I really want to use this inside the shower. That way I know that my hair has even more moisture for it to lock in. But even though I was just using my spray bottle, my hair felt amazingly soft and moisturized on rinse out. And I honestly cannot wait to try this again in a few more weeks. I don't want to over moisturize my hair and see what type of results that I get. Y'all, this is pure dedication at this point. It's way past my bedtime. So 
I'm about to wash this moisturizing treatment out of my hair. I didn't use much. I don't know if you guys can tell. I'm pretty proud of myself, but I'm gonna rinse this out um, in the shower and I'm gonna go in with the banana leave-in conditioner. It says it can help control dandruff. I'm gonna go ahead and apply this while I'm in the shower. So I probably won't have much to say except for how my hair feels. And then we're gonna come back and we are going to style with the okra curl defining gel. Oh, I can't wait. Don't come for me. Do not come for me. Y'all know I don't like using shower caps and Target bags are thick and they get the job done. So this is what my hair looks like. It has completely, at least by the look of it, um, absorbed that uh, banana leave-in conditioner. Oh, my hair feels really soft. I, I may have went in with too much. Oh my goodness though, like look at Fred. Fred looks good. Fred looks happy. Mm, my hair is getting so thick, you guys. Okay, I am i don't have time to sit here and play. Um, so I still have my water bottle handy just in case I need it. I might need to refill it. And like I said, we're gonna go in with the Okra Curl Defining Gel. Okra may not be your favorite, but this nutrient-rich vegetable has some amazing benefits for your hair. Okra contains vitamins A, C, and K, which are great for the overall health of your hair and scalp. Okra has a high mucilage content, which helps to create defined, shiny curls. It also has great antibacterial properties. Our Okra Curl Defining Gel will leave your curls bouncy and defined while providing a lasting hold. Directions say after cleansing and conditioning hair, apply our banana leave-in conditioner or avocado moisture cream thoroughly. Split hair into small sections and apply gel to wet or soaking wet hair. Use fingers to rake, smooth, and or shingle each section. Rewet section if necessary. For best results, diffuse or sit under a hooded dryer to set the hair. And while I have you guys' attention, if you are enjoying today's video so far, please do me a really big favor. Hit the thumbs up, leave a comment, any questions that you may have below. And if you really, really, really are enjoying this, please go ahead and subscribe. It just really helps me out on the algorithm and lets YouTube know that they are showing my content to people who actually enjoy it. Thank you. So let me tell you, like you see this, like this, moisturize undefined it's fine like don't get me wrong but like this product y'all is working wonders on my hair okay like i'm over here astounded i don't know if you can tell so I know you've been watching but i just want to do it one good time for the camera we're gonna soak this down Y'all see that? It's literally like dripping from my head. And we're gonna go in with an ample amount of this ochre gel. We're gonna spread it out real good. And the way this glides onto my hair, when my hair is soaking wet, lets me know for my preference, I would love to do this wash and go in the shower. I didn't feel like doing it today, but I already know just because of how good this feels going on my hair soaking wet. It's almost like it's it's like it's it's smoothing and it's also like clumping like it's almost like detangling if that makes sense like it's definitely like adhering to the hair even though i have the leave-in on but it is defining every single strand of hair and it just feels so incredibly smooth and gliding onto my hair like this just feels really nice so far so far i don't want to put the, the cart before the horse but like it just looks so good like my coils just look so defined 
I even have a little hang time with it. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm really excited for these results. I am going to, mm, I think I'm going to sit underneath my hooded dryer. I'm not going to bed. Oh, come on now. Don't do this. I'm not going to go to bed with wet hair. We don't do that anymore. So, um, I'm going to sit underneath the dryer for an ample amount of time. If I need to use my Dyson and diffuse for 10, 15 minutes or just blow dry it, I will do that. But, you know, typically I will come back on here and kind of show you what it looks like when it's fully set. But, not tonight. So once I get this fully applied, you guys will see me sometime tomorrow. Woo child, let's get into these final results of this Nature's Little Secrets wash day. Um, I'm gonna go product by product. We will start with the Fenugreek Detangling Pre-Poo. So I know that it contains peppermint and it even has a scent of peppermint. I just wish I had a little tingle on my scalp, but my scalp is in shambles. So I, that's really just a personal preference. But this is something that I can see myself using on a regular basis. I love this slip. I love how it detangled. I love the ingredients and I really liked it. So this I would definitely repurchase. Glad that I tried it out. 10 out of 10, highly recommend clarifying shampoo lemon and rosemary clarifying shampoo so we all know like rosemary is the thing right now like it's so crazy how that happens but i really like this a little goes a long way i love the instant soft lather it was not stripping at all i didn't even cleanse my hair twice and i still feel like my hair and scalp was clean especially because i used both of these on my scalp uh and it didn't dry my scalp nor my hair out could detangle my strands loved it and like it's so viscous like it's very like liquidy i really like this i think the reason why i started straying away from so many natural like really handmade products was just that like it was just starting to feel like they were so heavy and just really with a lot of things that i just no longer want to put on my hair but let's keep it going next i went in with the agave nectar moisturizing treatment this oh my gosh the smell so good um i don't really know because i had already detangled my hair so there was no need for me to try and detangle it uh my hair is very moisturized this is something that i don't know how to give it like a really great review first impression because it's a moisturizing treatment and yes my hair felt moisturized definitely didn't feel dry i i like the application it's it was good um check back definitely check back because i'm going to keep using it i just can't say for sure how i feel about it i do not have the banana cream leave-in conditioner near me but baby that was thick i did not expect that like it was just as thick as this moisturizing treatment so in combination my hair was super soft and super moisturized which is why i can't give you a definite on this but i like it i like it enough i'm interested enough to keep using it the banana leave-in conditioner will definitely keep using that like y'all we are on a roll with this and so last but not least we have the okra curl defining gel you see the results you see the definition in the past i had one of you guys tell me that this was super hard holding um just as hard as the b girl cu curl custard and i did not have that same like result like this is actually quite soft um i like the definition but honestly my hair looks and feels about the same as it did when i just did that ajua wash and go with the melon berry and i think for the same reasons is why i got the same results like my hair was just way too moisturized like super moisturized before going in with this and it really made me realize that like it's not always the product but it's also like the technique when it comes to applying the products that give you different results so 
I also noticed that like certain spots are like harder and have more of the crunch that I like versus some of them that are a lot softer. For instance, I thought my hair was fully dry, but when I woke up this morning, it was still kind of damp in some places. And in those places, I don't have as much hold. But where I was able to like air dry, I mean diffuse and not really manipulate my hair, um, I got more of the whole hold. So I believe if I would have sat underneath my hooded dryer like I intended, I really would have gotten like that B-girl custard type hold. But because I use such moisturizing products, and moisture's not an issue, but it's just keeping that in mind with my hair was so moisturized and then going in on that, it kind of lessened the hold on this. So, I mean, like a lot of you all, oh my God, this scared me. So a lot of you all really like, <laughs> a lot of you all really like flexible holes. So you would definitely love this. I like more of a firm hole, something that I know is really going to last a lot longer, but I really like it. Like the definition goes crazy. So to wrap this video up, I was thoroughly impressed with every single product that I tried today from Nature's Little Secret. I am impressed to say the least. You guys did not leave me wrong. Y'all were not playing when y'all said that Nature's Little Secret is really great products. Um, and I'm excited to see what else that they come out with. Comment down below and let me know what else you have tried. What else do you love? Because like, I'm on board now. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate each and every one of you and I will see you in the next one.